They've been trying to create an online space that is safe for everyone to use. And I think this is in a way an achievement for them. WhatsApp, more than any other mobile messaging company, has taken encryption to the masses. Computer forensic and system security experts like Arthur Niwagawa believe that this development has made it impossible for governments to intercept and access even the most secret of data shared on this platform. If there should be a law that requires maybe the end users, you or me, uh, to surrender my phone and open it for them, then probably at that level they can maybe uh, get to know about your, about your conversations. But short of that, within the communication medium, they lose it. They, they can no longer do it. In Brazil last year, a court ordered phone companies to block WhatsApp for two days after the company refused to hand over messages related to a drug trafficking trial. The only reason I would care a bit is, uh, I mean, people, I have privacy, I need my privacy. There are times I'm speaking on my phone and I hear an echo, and I'm told that once I hear an echo, someone is listening to me. So do you know what I do? When I hear that echo, I'll go like, excuse me, you person who's listening, please stop listening to my conversation. And immediately the echo goes. That's what you do? Yes. Uh, securing your end, end, end device, let's say your phone with a, a password, a PIN, that, that's good practice if you want to have uh, privacy, uh, privacy of your data. Make sure that at all times you log out so that the next person who uh, accesses your phone is not able to snoop into uh, what, what takes, place, uh, takes place within that. Other messaging apps with end-to-end -end encryption include Telegram, which is known to be used by the so-called Islamic State, or ISO, to share information. Imagine this with me, that every time you're Facebooking or WhatsApping, there's someone on the other side listening in or following every conversation that you're having on your phone. Not a good idea, is it? Well, for the more than a billion users of WhatsApp across the whole world, encryption is a major victory, especially when it comes to the right to privacy, but for governments whose preoccupation and priority is security, this is going to be a big battle to win. For NTV Tonight, I'm Brian Malondo.